And a very warm and uh, not so warm, a wettish welcome to Kenilworth here, yeah, Hollywood Bets Kenilworth today. We've got a nice eight race program for you on this Monday, but prior to that, we've got some news for Saturday as well. Obviously, Saturday, the final big meeting here of the Western Cape fixture season. It is going to be Derby Day and a whole lot of seafood and jazz on order as well. It looks set to be a brilliant end to what's been an absolutely awesome season. But one of the last events on the card comes Saturday is going to be the Kaya Stables Jockey Work Rider Partnership Race and a great incentive and 200,000 Rand up for grabs on this race and there are just 10 runners that are lining up which means they're going to be uh, ridden by five jockeys and five work riders and we are going to now do the draw for those respective teams but firstly let's introduce the captains captains are with well, the captain of the jockeys and that's going to be MJ Bailafelt although he's retired and he's still probably at his peak riding weight of about 104 kilograms MJ, how's things going in terms of your team? You happy with the five you got? Yeah, Grant, thanks very much for that introduction. But yeah, taking him to the seat quite comfortably and, and just leading up to or trying to get to your size. So it's, it's, it's a bit of a struggle, but it's, it's getting there. So no, we're happy with the jocks. Obviously, good, good riders um, taking part. And I'm sure the grooms are very excited about it again. Yeah, lo lovely initiative. And always nice when there's such good prize money as well, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Um, uh, unfortunately, I only got 10 runners. But I mean, it's really a, a good prize money. And thanks to Kai Stables, the grooms really... Um, they, they really get excited about this. Uh, the jocks are a bit scared. They don't want to get shamed. But yeah, but if it's scared or they're just too scared that they're going to be shamed, that's probably the, the main thing. But last year we showed them up. So, uh, Craig, I don't know how prepared they are. Work riders riding master is Craig Deploy, and he's obviously going to be looking after team groom. And you've got uh, five runners in terms of five riders that are going to be taking part for your team. And tell us about the five that you drew. You happy with your team? Very happy. They are the top five on the log. So, yeah, as the, as the log stands, we've got the best. And can you take on the, uh, the real boys and give them a bit of a run? Well, we take them on in a day-to-day -day at work, so why not give it a go on the track? Excellent stuff. Right, now, what we need to do, we need to get a starting point from you two gentlemen in terms of who's going to draw first. So I think uh, maybe a Ching Chong shows in order who gets to draw the first jockey. MJ's going to be pulling out the jockey's names. Craig, you're going to be pulling out the work rider's names. And then uh, that'll be the team. Now, just to let you know, the winning jockey on the day is going to get just under 12,000 Rand. That's going to be the stake that uh, he earns for a 200,000 Rand race. The winning work rider, the work rider who finishes first, will also get that. That'll be matched uh, to about 11,800 odd Rand. But then the team prize, the winning jockey and the winning rider coupled together, that's the team we're going to be drawing now. They get 20,000 Rand, so that's another 10,000 Rand each. So nice money up for grabs once again. And a massive thank you to Lady Christine Laidlaw for giving us this <laughs> initiative here on the last race day here at Hollywood Bets for the season. Hollywood Bets Kenilworth. Right, guys, let's get this show underway. Best King of three or just one? One, sudden death. One off. On three. Death. Count Ready. to three. Ready, let's okay. go. One, two, three. You have to go again now. This okay. is dead heat. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, Jeez, come on, come on. Go okay. One, best to three. One, one, two, three. three. You joke? Really? Okay. Okay. Craig, you go. Last one. Last one. Come okay. on. Last one. Okay, go. One, two, three. Okay. I will go. Okay. Let Craig go. Great minds. Good luck. Four dead heats and racing hasn't even started today. Right. <laughs> Let's kick off then. Your name's Craig. They're in that trophy. You can pull the first name up. Hold it up to the camera. Right. Who is it? Vasily and Kunzeb. Now yep. tell us a little bit about him first. He was the first work rider home last year, so he picked up the big check last year. Okay. And uh, yeah, he's a very good rider. He rides for the Candace Bass Yard. Yeah, any horse with half a chance, he produces. He's clearly got big match temperament then as well. Absolutely, and very geared up for this race. All right, who's going to be his partner, MJ? Let's dig down uh, deep and find out who the jockey is that's going to be partnering him. 
Pierre Corne Offer. Pierre Corne Offer. All right, there's a combination. Guys, how strong is that team? Pretty strong. Is that a good one? Okay. I think Corne is very happy. Okay, yeah. Corne needed all the help he could possibly get. Right, Craig. Together. Get stuck in there and uh, draw your next work rider name out. Who we got there? Sipiwo Feni, right. We know that he's a very capable work rider. Let's see who's going to be partnering him. Louis Mkotwa. Louis Mkotwa, right. That's another very strong very partnership strong. there. That's a, that's a partnership that could be a favourite, one of them. Possibly take home the big check. Anything, Louis, it's only a, a maiden racer. He's, he's used to the group ones nowadays. So yeah, that's... To see, eh? <laughs> Same prize. I'll have to talk to him. I need to have a, <laughs> Captain needs to have a chat to Louis. I that's think you'll have sure. to have a chat with him maybe during the course <laughs> of today when we're uh, having a race. You can throw your equipment around as well, Craig. No worries about that. Right. Let's move on. Who have you got? Godfrey Sigeni. Sigeni, right. Let's have a look. Godfrey, uh, a very capable rider. And as Craig said, these are the top guys. And look who he's pulled. He's pulled Rich and Free, who's Richard going to be riding for Ricky Mangard as well on the card. So uh, a very strong partnership as well. Top Tell you what, if you're going to be uh, opening betting on these partnerships, it's going to be quite close in the market. There's a couple of really good pairings here. Craig's up next. And Lebe. Now we know him. He's been a frequent winner of work rider races. And he's getting the services as a partner of Oi, Keegan Tamela. Jeez, that must be the favourite. Automatically, we've just seen the odds on favourites emerge. This is Justin's work rider and uh, Keegan's riding Justin's horse. So. Is that the guy okay. that Justin says is his next stable jock? No. Oh. That's <laughs> Steve Fanny. Oh. Right, one more to go, guys. Let's see who we're going to get. William Bambiso. William Bambiso tried and tested household names when it comes to work riders races here in the Western Cape. And he's and teaming up with, with Aldo Thunder. De Mayer, yeah. another really strong partnership. So those are the pairings that will be uh, put together no. in terms of the press releases. And obviously, as I just recall, 11,800 Rand each to the winning rider. That's the jockey. You'll get the same amount for the winning work rider, 11,800 odd Rand. And the winning team, the teams we've just paired now, they'll come home with 20,000 Rand, another 10,000 Rand each. Right. Craig, on the spot, who's your money on now? Who are you going to be siding with? I think Sipo Feni, riding for Lucinda Woodruff. Yeah. And uh, I think he's got probably the best form horse in the race. A uh, lot of potential. So, yeah, I think he will he's the pick of your, put up your a team. good performance on Saturday. All right. Captain MJ, what, uh, who do you think? Kind of... Keegan, defending champion. Definitely. All right. Riding top of his game. So, yeah, champion jock. Fantastic stuff. Well, well, there you have it. That's the draw, ladies and gentlemen, for the race. It's going to be race 10 on Saturday. Tickets are still available. We invite you to come enjoy seafood, jazz, and some fine quality horse racing as well.